everyone so welcome back to easy tech masters online series and here we go uh, with the one more ac fundamentals program problem this is very beautiful let us see what is that hmm. this is the problem and what he has given in the sense that is the coil is there coil in the sense coil represents r yeah do remember this coil is the combination of resistance and inductance and same thing coil or choke coil whatever it may be whenever we give this kind of thing in the problem you need to consider this is the combination of r and l like this hmm. he says that the power factor of this coil is 0.9 okay that means cos pi is equal to 0.9 then you can find out the pi here what is pi cos inverse of 0.9 and this may be cos inverse of 0.9 in the sense 25.84 degrees so let us we have this and what is this pi the angle of this one what is the angle of this one if z is equal to r plus j omega x j x l let it be not omega l whatever it may omega l or x l r plus j x l then what is the angle here pi is equal to tan inverse x l by r and here you know the value of pi that is 25.84 Is equal to tan inverse of x l by r. From this, what is x l by r? X l by r is equal to tan of twenty five point eight four. So hence we can write tan of twenty five point eight four is zero point four eight four like this. Therefore. You can write x l by r is equal to zero point four eight four. Therefore, you can write x l is equal to zero point four eight four r. Let it be. This is one equation. One equation. Ah. Next, what he says? This is over coil. The coil is over. Next, it is connected in series with the one twenty microfarads capacitor. That is, this is coil which contains resistor, inductance. It is connected in series with the capacitance like this. Capacitor. When circuit is connected to fifty hertz supply, he did not mention the voltage. Just he has given. the frequency the potential difference across the coil is potential difference across the capacitor that means if i assume this is v1 and this is v2 he says that v1 is equal to v2 if it is so what is the value of resistance and inductance r and l we need to find yes when v1 is equal to v2 what is v1 vr square plus vl square under the root This is equal to V to his voltage across capacitor. Yes. Okay. Then, if you simplify this equation, that is, uh, you can write V R square plus V L square is equal to V C square and V R square. And what is V C? V L. V L. You can write this as. So directly can write like this. We are in the sense I into R whole square plus I into X L whole square is equal to I into X C whole square. On the both sides, we can make the cancel of can cancel I I square. Then you can write R square plus X L square is equal to X C square. 
ओके नाउ फ्रॉम ई क्वेश्चन वन एक्सएल इज इक्वल टू जीरो पॉइंट फोर एट फोर फोर नाउ यू सब्सिट्यूट एक्सएल हियर देन यू मे हैव दैट इज आर स्क्वायर प्लस जीरो पॉइंट फोर एट फोर आर फोर स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू एक्सी एक्सी इन द सेंस Yes. What is x? X is equal to one by omega c, and you can also write one by two pi f c. That is one by two pi fifty h into c is one twenty microfarads. One twenty into micro in the sense ten power minus six minus six. And if you do this one, you will get. Twenty six point five two six ohms. Twenty six point five two six ohms. So now I am substituting this value directly. Okay. So that is R square plus zero point four eight four R whole square. This will be equal to x in the sense twenty six point five two six whole square. Now we can solve the e this equation for r. If you solve this equation, you will get one point two three four r square is equal to twenty six point five two six whole square. Then from this R is equal to you will get 23.88 ohms. You already got the R. Now from equation one, what is equation one? X L is equal to 0.484 into R. So now you substitute this R there. X L is equal to 0.484 from equation one. Into twenty three point eight eight is equal to eleven point double five, and you know that X L is omega y eleven point double five eight. Then what is y eleven point double five eight by omega? What is omega here? Eleven point double five eight divided by two pi. Into 50 h. Ah, therefore, how much value you will get? This is 0.03679, or you can also write this as 36.79 milli hendrix. So hence, resistance is this one. Inductance is. This one. Yes, thank you for watching this. Keep uh, watching my channel. Try to subscribe, share, like the channel. Thank you.